Okay, solid Mustang here. How is everybody doing? Hope everybody's having a good day. Hope everybody's ready for the holidays. Everybody, please drive safe if you're driving around. And I hope you're having a nice holiday. Hope you get a lot of playing in. So let's cut right to this because this game goes by fast because we stomp some people. Um, I'm going to talk about loadouts here and how you choose your loadout. One reason you choose your loadout is because of who you're playing Team with. Death match. If you're playing with somebody long, you know, a group of people who fight long range, you have to shift off that shotgun or SMG. If you play somebody who um, camp out a lot, have a camping um, loadout ready. My personal camping loadout is the SN6, uh, the third, which is one of the variants of it. Silencer. A uh, quick draw scope and either a front grip or um, laser uh, or the parabolic uh, microphone, one of those things. And then smoke grenades. I will pop smoke in front of the camper so you can't see. One of two things going to happen. One, I'm going to get him to move. Or two, he's going to try to stay there, try to look through it or try to shoot through it. I'm going to be able to get around. Or, I'll even use it as a pump fake, shoot that at him, pop out around the corner, so he gets up and moves. What he does, he ends up running right into me, and now I have the advantage up close. So, anyways, we'll go through the maps here real quick. So, the maps are Ascend. In the Ascend map, that's going to be um, a long range. You're going to have a lot of long range fighting in there. So... Make sure you adjust accordingly. I like my above. HBR or the INS in that. Um, you can get in some close range fighting though in that if you're smart about it. Be smart about it. Biolab, I like my SMG in here. Um, or the BAL. Because you do get in a lot of close quarters. You can get in some long range fights. And I know guys like the HBR a lot in here and it's not bad. But there's a lot of areas you get in up close, so maybe something like the AK or something like that if you do want to get a little longer range fighting. But I like my SN6 there. Next up, uh, after Biolab, is going to be Comeback that's in Lagos, and you're going to be long range fighting. Here's where my INS comes in really handy. The four round burst, I can drop people one, two burst, and three burst usually with a silencer. You got to figure you're not hitting all the bullets, so... Bombing, if you get a good way. burst on a guy, even with a silencer at good range, you're talking one, two burst, and they're done. If you guys are liking to hide on top of buildings, again, smoke is not a bad way to go with that. Um, but grenades are pretty helpful in there, too. Defender, where the tsunami is, this is long range all day long. Snipers love this map. So, keep that in mind. Snipers love this map. If you like sniping, Enemy UAV here's above. where you can really be um, effective. If you don't, the INS, um, the Mark 14 is pretty good in this map. So just keep that in mind, it's a long range map. Next is not a long range map. This is Shotgun Heaven, as well as the SMG, and that's Detroit. You are going from building to building to building, and you're getting in usually pretty close quarter combat. You're going to want something rapid fire type deals so again that's probably where you want to go with that um, green band is one map I have not fared out yet and I typically get in longer range fights so I'm usually using the HBR it's real camped out I haven't really found a good way it did, the map just doesn't seem like a good flow it's definitely not my favorite map if you know a good way to play that, let me know. I like to try to figure out how I want to play that map. I haven't figured that one out yet. Probably because I keep skipping it. I don't like that map. Um, Horizon. Friendly assault drone in floating, sh floating ship in the middle. I think I said that earlier for a different map. Sorry about that. Um, long range fighting in here. This is going to be your long range fight. Lots of long range areas. A lot of areas you're going to have to run through you know, some distance. So get something with a little more range to it. I have a lot of success with the INS and the HBR in here. So LMG can be pretty effective in here as well. Um, snipers, you get some good points in there as, as well. So, 
Instinct we are recovered. Um, what's we doing next? Oh, recovery. Recovery where the volcano. That's going to be your long range fighting. So you're talking an AK 12 or the uh, HVR. Those are going to be your best bets there. Um, again, that thing just seems to be camped out all the time. So, um, last one's Riot. Riot is one of those that you can fight kind of however you want. And Detroit is kind of like this too, but I think the SMG is, is pretty much the best there. But Riot, you can pretty much any way you want. There's long range or short range, so you can get in whatever kind of fight you want. Solar, um, this is more long range, but you can get in some close range fighting. So I'm I'm liking my uh, AK-12 here a lot. I've had a lot of success with my uh, submachine gun as well. So. Just for your uh, FYI on that, but you're probably more looking at your um, assault rifle range. After solar, we got our terrace here. Terrace is another one you can pretty much fight any way you want. Um, assault rifles are good because you can get some, you know, medium range fights. Snipers, I've seen snipers be successful in certain areas, but there's a lot of flank points, so heads up on that. Uh, but, like I said before, other than the maps, and that's all the maps Squad, that, was um, that are not on the DLC. Other than that, then you're kind of looking at who you're playing with and however you like to play. No matter which way you like to play, I hope you're having a good time. Hope to see you over here over the holidays. And have a nice Thanksgiving, however you celebrate it. So, anyways, Sal Mustang, don't worry, I got your six. See you later.